Hello everyone, welcome back to Trip Dog Gaming here on YouTube. This is the game Grounded and we are now in episode 79. Well, we're down here collecting resources and the occasional bit of food um, that we need to sort of finish off that little bridge that we're making right over towards the wheelbarrow. Um, so I've been down here for a little while off camera, just grinding, getting stuff. I kind of was thinking I might make a little stem base. Not not huge, just a small one. Meals on wheels. There's been a lot of aphids around. This dude doesn't even realise I'm right here. Look! <laughs> um, so I decided I am going to grab some resources from here, take it back to that base area. Uh, it's reasonably early in the morning in the game. We're just going to see how far we can push this final little bit because I don't... I want to end up going down towards the shed. That's the direction I kind of want to take fairly soon. So I've got a feeling I've gone, um, you know, when people say you've bitten off more than you can chew, well, that's kind of what I feel like at the moment. So I'm going to build a little bit of a, a base of some sort uh, over towards the wheelbarrow. Because last episode, I couldn't believe how bad that area is. All the level 3 animals are all there, so um, the black ox beetle's there, so he's level 3. Then I think I saw um, at least one anyway, Roly Poly, he's level 3. And that ladybird seems to be level 3. Um, and then there was fire ants. It was like unbelievable. And I did pass, um, you know, supposedly a level 2 um, wolf spider over there as well. So. Oh my goodness, there's nothing there that's easy to, to battle, so... Oh well, at least I've explored and got a path going in that direction. So I think today's episode, we're going to sort of, I guess, try to consolidate how far we've pushed and see if we can make something uh, over there. Because I've got a, I've got a few um, of the stems on that pallet. Uh, actually, in fact, hang on. How many can I put on there? Only a few. Okay. Um, so I was just thinking I'll take... Uh, a few full pallets of materials over there, and we'll see if we can build something. It doesn't have to be fantastic, just so that we know that we can get all the way over there, and then we can launch, a, a, I guess, a stronger exploration um, video, I guess, or episode, where we have to take on some of these animals, or the insects, sorry. So, yeah, it's going to be uh, a little bit of a handful to do that because there's just so many, so many level 3 creatures in this area. They're all about to come out. As soon as I get over here, they start to kind of realise I'm here. There's the ox beetle. There was one on the right. I've got a feeling there's a hole under here somewhere. There you go. <laughs> it's, oh, gee, it's a worry. Uh, hopefully on camera... You can hear that as well. It's a little bit scary, kind of thing, because he's blinking loud. Um, oh yeah, and there's orb weaver spiders as well. <laughs> it's just like nuts. How hard is this going to be? So anyway, I can get to here. Oh, there's another ox bit. Like he, I don't know if I'm really well protected here or not. So here's the question, should I be building this here? Yeah, something's gonna spot me. He's gonna spot me. Look, there you go. Look, have fun with that. Don't throw stuff at me. It does the old charging thing. It does make me think, I wonder if... See, he can't see me then at another point. I don't know. Maybe I should just build it here. Yeah, maybe I should build it here. It feels actually more secure than there. I don't know whether that's easier for him to get up, because it's kind of closer to the ground, but... Uh, how about if we build it here? So hang on. Let's craft... Uh, Construction-wise... Oh, that's what we need a lot of crude rope, too. Oh! We need everything, basically. Um, okay. Cannot build in combat. No, oh, for crying out loud, would you guys <laughs> rack off? Look, no one's here, right? Not in combat, he can't see me. It's kind of when you think, oh, it'd be good to get the wall up, then he won't be able to see me then. Let's try this again. Don't look up here, dude. Can't I join that? 
Maybe I can't. Uh, can I join? No, oh, he's not joining onto it, so I, okay. Well, I'll just have to make it. Maybe it's a 3 by 3 uh, Part of me doesn't want to make it a 3 by 3 because it hangs over the outside area, so it's like, that could be annoying. Um, so can I start? I can start fe feeding these in anyway. I don't think it'll build onto there until I've got those in place, so, okay. So, hang on. So, back here I've got lots of stems still, which will help. I might go back... Uh, actually, just let me grab these, even though it's only two, let's just empty the pallet. And take it back. Let me just put these over here. So we'll take, um, we'll go back and get the crude rope, and then we'll take the stem pellet that's back at the the base just here, uh, back over here, so we've got more stems to play with. I just wish I could get down into here, look at all the materials in here, but oh my goodness, you'd have to battle just, you know, 20 creatures or something to make the area safe enough for you to go and harvest stuff. <laughs> Just everywhere. Look. It's another. Is it Ladybird? It's Ladybird. Yeah, it's Ladybird. Not Lady Beetle. So the Lady Beetles are a tough one to fight, but they're just friendly. Like, they don't do anything. But the Ladybird's very angry. Very, very angry little beetles, apparently. So, yeah. Um. We don't have a means of making... Maybe we should have had crude rope making stuff here. Like, one of the grinders should be here, really, shouldn't it? I use so much of it, that's the problem. Alright. Did I have much in the way of it in here? Oh, I did bring over some. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, there you go. I've got 20. Uh, hang on. I'm standing next to it, so how about we make a few more... Uh, we'll be crafting again crude rope. See, it's kind of not the most efficient way of doing it. How many did I say I needed? Hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on. So when I'm when I'm crafting the stem floor, it needs two, and I put down three by three. So total of nine by two is eighteen. So I need it. Li I've got that already, haven't I? Yeah, easy. Alright, well how about if we just make another two, so bring it up to 25, then we grab our additional stem pellet, we'll take this back with us. I, I can see this area being absolutely fantastic, a lot of fun to play in, a bit of a challenge, oh, well, probably more than a bit of a challenge, but you, you know what, it might not be that much of a challenge once we get a little bit higher up in our armour and that. So don't forget, I'm still using the original ant armour, I haven't upgraded to anything, I mean, I could do koi armour, I could do lady beetle armour, there's quite a few, so I have to have a think about that. I guess we're just kind of stretching our exploration legs in as many directions as we can. Every time I get to here, I keep thinking he's going to spot me, but there you go. <laughs> Whatever spotted me. It doesn't quite tell you, but I think what's happening is it, it's more than likely the black ox beetles, I think. That are just so annoyed at me. Oh yeah, it might have been that guy. See, they're on both sides, they're the ladybirds. <laughs> oh, for crap's sake. And the orm weaver spiders, and oh jeez. Alright, so I've got, hang on. Can I... hang on. Let me just move this up a bit closer. Could it reach it from there? It probably can. Who spotted me now? Oh, hang on a second, hang on a second. Who's, ho who's fighting who down here? So hang on, the... The orb weaver's having a crack at someone else. Don't fall off the log, Trev. What's he attacking? I take it the Orb Weaver, even the Orb Weaver Juniors, they don't, they don't like the um, Fire Ants. Why are we 
was he having? He was angry about something. I'm not sure what he was having a go at. Anyway. His problem. Okay, so one's done. That one. At least get our foundation done. Hey, that'd be good. So we're going to run out of... Weed stems. No, we're not. We're going to have enough because... I just wonder if I didn't pick those up, hey? So we need another three, four, seven, nine. Hang on, this old pallet over here. They're just too far away, I think. Couldn't reach. Alright, so let's move this guy. At least that's cool though. We'll have this um, in, in place. Ready to go. Jeez. <laughs> oh man. Can't wait to get the walls up. You don't see me. Honestly, you don't see me. It's not going to let me build anything while I'm in battle, supposedly. Who says I'm in battle? Okay, so... Mm, maybe we should make the bottom level like that. I think. That's what I would want to do. Okay, so it kind of looks like that. And then we just got to make a doorway. It doesn't line up 100%, but I think it should be fine. Worst scenario is we have to build another four of those across there, but yeah, this one lines up pretty well. Okay, so it's just a whole bunch of stems, isn't it? Um, this seems to be my worst area, so guess what? <laughs> see you later! Well, hopefully he can't see me. I'm not sure whether he, he can't, can or can't now. Alright, so we need a bunch more stems. We'll put a little bit of a... Actually, this side here, going back towards the pond or whatever, needs to be... Well, seems to be a little quieter, so I might put the staircase on this side, I think. So what have we got? One, two, three, four, five... Yeah, I need another pallet or two, don't I? Oh, for crying out loud. <laughs> Where, where was he when he saw me? No, oh, he's just there. Uh, he's a bit of a dipstick. Anyway. Alright, well, let's go and grab a few more resources. Kind of looking forward to doing even more exploring, but oh man, we're going to be... We're going to need to be a little bit more OP'd, I think. And I, I don't know what the solution is there. Do I... I think I need to blink them all learn how to parry <laughs> properly. Because it'd be so much easier just to do a, a full on. I mean, maybe you can carry some of the attacks if you've got better armor as well. I mean, that's highly possible. I might take this back to base, have a sleepy. Um, there's only so many stems I can grab from around the tick base, too, hey, before I kind of run out for a couple of days. Um, I should fix that, too keep having to kind of jump. Alright, uh, I'm not sure if it's really it's worth no it. Women crime, but it's better than nothing. Probably come back in the morning anyway. What is the time? Is it time for sleep? He's not quite close though. Uh, put a light on in the house. I wonder, see that day, the, the ladybird was up here on this platform, that's what worries me a bit. Because if I can't, I don't know how... Uh, I don't know. How <laughs> I don't know how I would battle it. I'd have enough trouble with Lady Beetle, let alone this Ladybird. Meant to be level three or whatever. Uh, I can't hear her at the moment. I was just thinking, can I get out here and, and knock over one of the um, dandelions before she realizes I'm here? Where is it? It's in here somewhere. Down the line. It's only the one, wasn't it? Oh, I think I can hear her. I'm not here. I've got grass as well. <laughs> what? How'd I do that? 
I'll take it, yeah. Like Heather was telling me that from way back, you can basically pick up a combination of the two. I never realised that was the case. Until quite a few episodes later. Um, okay, let's take this back. We've got some resources before nightfall. Always oh, spooky gives me the, the willies. Uh, hang on, I had one on the ceiling, didn't I? Actually, I've got two stem pellets there. I've got one back over there. I've got four here, actually. Uh, hang on. And the rest is grass. Alright, it's probably time for a sleepy. Alright, people, I am going to go to bed, and I'll catch you in the morning. I'm not sure if you heard that, but um, while I've had my great night's sleep, um, something water-wise, I'm not sure whether that was something here going on, because it was close to me, or whether it was in the water. Unless it was the koi jumping around. I've still got to get that molar too. I keep talking about it, and I'm never doing it. Alright, that's cool. What food have I got left? Uh, actually, there's two more there to cook, which is good. Alright, let's roast and toast. That one, that one. So that's a cooking. Eh. Uh, can we grab a little bit more? It's a pity this area just over here near this bush here didn't have a few more dandelions. And there's some just in here, but you can't get them very easily because the. Ladybird lava is kind of all over the shop there. In the way. Oh, I need to get these down, they're kind of stuck in the grass here. Yeah. Down. Yeah. You fallen down yet? Come on. That's it. Oh, it's stuck up. Which one's it stuck on? That one. Let me get through. That's what I'm chasing. There you go. Four of each. Thanking you very much, game. As the bee decides to visit the base. Alright. So... Uh, four there... Four there... I'm not sure really how many more stems I can get from around this area, hey? Without going in there and having a battle with the larvae, guys. Um, wonder if I just take, hang on. I might just take one of the empty ones back in this direction. Sorry, Heather, I've kind of done the whole, um, I, I did uh, disassemble and reassemble, but, eh. I guess because I'm running on platforms all the time, it's not a huge deal. At least I don't have to worry about reassembling it, I suppose. But carrying it through the forest of grass and that would be a nightmare, so I would definitely be doing it then. But while I'm on the platforms, I'll just do this, I suppose. Um. Um, 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 um. Yeah, I don't think there's any other places where I can get the stems from very easily. I could go to the area to my left right now, or coming up just to my left now, but it's tick infested, so you got to battle them, and they take a while. So it's like, it's so annoying. And there's quite a few dandelions just here that would be really good to be able to um, harvest. But you got to stand there and just run around with 20 arrows to kill your little ticks, and I just heard one. Oh, he's probably chasing that aphid that just ran up the... <laughs> up the grass. Wouldn't mind making the... Apparently there's turrets. I think the turrets are only for the flying animals? Insects? What the crap? I've got to go through there, you know. Are you quite happy there? Oh, jeez. <laughs> Bumble off, Bumblebee! Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Bumble off. 
Oh, while I'm here. That was refreshing. Uh, hang on, hang on. Just let me save the game. Just checking. If I walk up to him, does he actually just move away? I can't even push him out of the way. Look at this dude. You're in the way. <sighs> um, could always have a Barney with him. I've got a base here. I kind of like the bees, but... You know he's going to come and damage my base, and I'll probably get killed. Oh, there's a little tick. Hang on a tick. Hey, don't let that tick get you! Really? Oh, honestly, game. <laughs> Jeez! No, no, hang on, hang on, hang on. See? Oh, for crying out loud, really? You know... I gather his path... pathing abilities is a little shot at the moment. Don't know why. wonder if you shoot them, can you run them off? Shoot him and then just run. Is he coming? Oh, he's coming. Alright, let me just, um... Keep running. Hopefully I don't run out of stamina. I reckon... Yeah, has he settled down? Oh no, he hasn't. <laughs> he's still red-eyed. Right off! Oh, now he's gone. Ah, oh, man. You happy now? I helped you out. Don't be angry at me. Where you go? Down there somewhere. Oh, is that him? That might be him. See, you got your pollen there, you happy? Yeesh. Trevor and the insects. I don't know. See, I don't, um... What? Oh, did he drop the arrow? Oh, maybe he did. Oh my goodness. The weird things I come across in Grounded. Anyway, I helped him out. Even if it was a bit painful. For him, that is. Hello, hello, hello! See, at least she doesn't get angry at me and just go straight past her and she's fine, but the ladybird... Man! Why so angry at me, the ladybird? Hang on. Ooh. Ooh. Why am I out of stamina? Oh, I can hear a weevil too. He'd be easier to get. I don't tell me he's stuck under the stone again. He might be. Here we go, little aphid boy. Got one. Where's the other one? At least I got a couple of more aphids, I suppose. Like, can you hear it? It's just he's under here somewhere. <laughs> I can't see ya. He's about here somewhere. He could technically just come straight back out. Anyhow. We'll leave him be, as funny as it is. Let's get back to our building operation. The good thing is, most of this area... Was there only five? No, no. Six. Most of this area is actually fairly safe. It's funny how grounded is kind of not quite biomed that way, but almost in the sense that some biomes are much safer than others. Hang on, isn't there another one down here somewhere? Is it further around? Oh no, just here. We might have to go back and put, uh, kind of put some of our stems together, perhaps. Don't need. 
Really, I should be just grabbing anything and everything I find all the time. Is that the, the bird again? Alrighty. I can still hear him stuck under there. How many have I got? I've got two aphids, which should be fine. What? Huh? Uh... Just thinking, um, how on earth did I end up with 30 clay? What? When did that happen? Did I empty a box? But if I did, I would have had more than just... Oh, maybe I did. Oh, man. I don't know. Go back to base and have a look. Oh, hang on. Uh, there is more dandelions in there, but they're in the slightly dangerous spidery area at the back there, so... I think there's a, um... Either a wolf spider or an orb weaver in under a leaf in that area somewhere, so... Not looking forward to that, so... Stay clear of him for a while. Wish it was easier, um... Just to kind of kill them in one hit. Make life a lot easier. Yeah, there is, um... Yeah, there's a few plants here I'd like to be able to harvest, but I have to... Muck around shooting all the ticks and get them all... I mean, it's not that big a deal. If I did do it, at least I'd have, um... A chance, I guess, to harvest some ticks. Get some more... Tick parts. But anywho, we'll take these back. We didn't need an awful lot to really finish off that bottom section, but... You know, maybe that's as far as we get in this episode. We get uh, a little bit of the the base completed. I'd like to have the walls up so that they, hopefully, fingers crossed, they... And when I say they, I mean the ox, black ox beetles in particular can't see me when I come into the base. It's even annoying when you're trying to finish off building the base, because you can't do that because they, they're in combat mode, even though you haven't decided to really have combat with them. So you're stuck waiting for them to de... remove themselves, I was going to say de-combat, but it's like removing themselves from combat mode so that you can continue building. <laughs> so it's kind of a bit annoying. Alright, let's, um, let's just have a look at this for a sec. So, Sean's got the most... probably that one. Uh, Yeah, okay. Uh, I probably could just carry these, actually, but... How many is that? that? I think that's three short. That must be 18 on there. Alright. Well, you know what? That's going to go an awful long way. Hang on, before I do. Before I forget. Don't fall off. Let me have a look back in this chest for a sec. Did I take... Oh, I don't think I did. I don't know where I got this clay from. I haven't been in any other chests as far as I know. Uh, I will keep that on me. It's funny seeing the tough gunk. A bit weird seeing the tough gunk. So there's the two food that I'm gonna have. Okay, let's just leave it like that. Oh no, I did it again! No, 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 no. <laughs> oh, for Pete's sake, Triff. I wish that key would not allow you to do that, or confirm it before you do it. Anyway, it's not in exactly the right order, but... Yep, I've got to remember, whenever you do that, you're looking at a chest or whatever... Hang on, where's my... I'll take these with me. Um, hit escape. Hit escape. Nothing else. So I don't carry everything with me. Oh man, that's annoying. Any hoot. Alright, well... Let's take our stems with us and see if we can complete a bit more of our base. Because I think um, if I do decide to attack the animals from this bridge slash base up this area near the wheelbarrow, I'm going to have to have an awful lot of arrows and potentially not necessarily this, the normal arrows. Because, you know, obviously, if I can do double the damage with a different arrow, I only need half as many to kill something in half the time. 
Oh, see, there's a fire ant down there. Hang on. I'm not sure exactly where they live. But potentially it's in that area there. It's where he seems to be going back to a lot. Anyway, here we go. I'll start a battle here in a sec. These stupid beetles that think I'm starting a combat session or whatever. I'm like, no, I'm not. I'm just minding my own business, building a base. There you go. <laughs> start it again. I think there's a way of getting through from one end to the other. <laughs> He's always angry at me. Man! There you go, I've used up all the stems, but at least I've done the bottom bit. That I don't mind so much. Um, alright. Let's just take this... He's gonna start up again, probably. You wanna fight me again? No, I'm just doing my own thing. Sorry. Well, I guess I kind of have to build it out of stems, because if he throws those boulders up at me, he's going to really smash the base to pieces if I'm not careful. Um, so I guess in, when we come to crafting more things... Uh, yeah, probably a stem floor would be there, 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 and there. And then somewhere on this side, we're just going to... I think I'm just going to do a grass um, set of stairs. So something like... Maybe something like that. Oh man, if I can get it just to sit. There you go. I think so. Because then I can go back to our normal stem floor and do it like that I think, that way I can kind of come up there, get onto the second level. I've got some crude rope. Which one should I do? Maybe that one? Uh, I think it won't let me do anything else, is that right? I think I have to do that first. Hang on. I've got two pieces of grass. There you go. So I basically need another pellet of stems and another another pellet of grass, I guess. Alright, let's get one of each of these back. There we go, big fight again. Oh, you're an idiot. <laughs> He's bored, so nothing else to do. Yeah, jeez, okay. Alright, well I guess, um, yeah, next episode I'm going to have to finish off this base. Maybe what I will do is just see if I can um, grind away a little bit more off camera, grab a few more resources. I don't think it needs anything else. I wish there was a gun or a turret or something that was land based. You know, that you could set them up outside your base and when the ox beetles come around they just get pounded by the catapults or turrets firing needle based stuff whatever, whatever. Projectiles of sorts. That'd kind of be fun. We did have a few... a few grass here, but yeah, I think I'm going to have to go and grab a whole bunch more materials, I think. Alright, guys, I think I'm going to have to leave the episode here, but, um, yeah, we're getting there. So next episode, I'm finishing that off. Definitely have to finish off that build in that corner, so we've got a base over there, and then, you know what, we're going to head that way all the way over to the shed and see what we find and then see if we can get up onto the shed I think because I think that's a no-go zone for the time being we've gone as far as we can without being hammered by these guys but I think I'm gonna have to upgrade a fair few things before I take on these guys uh, more easily I think anyhow I uh, hope you've enjoyed today's episode if you have yeah, you can go ahead and smash that like button will really help out the channel and even more so if you haven't already subscribed please consider subscribing. Alright everyone, thanks so much. Cheers.